Hey everybody, welcome back. Trailer reaction time. And today I'm here for something that could be very interesting, something I may or may not be able to show you any of. Today we got basically a blind trailer. It's a movie clips indie trailer. We're here to watch trailer number one for Skin, a history of nudity in the movies. <laughs> the Mr. Skin life story. Um, no, honestly, I have no idea if, if I'm going to have to blur this whole damn thing out or not. But if you want to see this trailer without me in the way, there's a link in the description below or something's popping up right about now. You can click on that. Check it out. Come on back. Watch me watch this and then we'll geek out over it together. Should it be geek out worthy? You can also get movie reviews, video game let's plays, support the channel, support me and Mary in this house and a whole lot more for as little as a dollar a month. If you want to, no worries, no pressure. Just like to let you know it's there. Extra video every single day. You can do that by checking out my Patreon and looking up The Eric Butts or using the link I have in the description below. But of course, I'm going to be here giving you free content every day as well and giving you that nice dose of positivity, high energy, something silly to laugh at or with, whatever, as long as you're entertained. So I do like to remind you that we will get through this. We will get through this together. And I like it when we do it again and you say it out loud with me. I can tell. I can tell when you're doing it. You're good, you're good, you're not, you're, <laughs> we will get through this, we will get through this together. All right, well, I mean, it's a documentary about nudity in film, so I am actually legitimately interested in the documentary aspect of it. I do find cinematography and lighting the body is very fascinating to me. That's something um, I'd like to practice more. <laughs> uh, but, you know, no, but seriously, I can enjoy the art, I can also perv out about it. So we're here to do both. Let's shut up, let's watch. <laughs> 20 minutes after they invented film, somebody started photographing naked people. Hollywood was a kind of Sodom on the Pacific. Middle America was up in arms. There were censorship boards. Moral police. Thou shall not do this, you should not have that, no nudity, and nothing licentious or lecherous. If the code movies teach us anything, it's that there are ways around all this stuff. You have people that the movies, not the seal of approval. It has sex, it has violence, it has the relationship between sex and violence. Subversive, stop. Marilyn Monroe was the first actress to prove that nudity does not destroy a career, it can even help a career. And then Jane Mansfield was right behind her. And Mamie Van Dora. Let's say Margaret, and she's naked. Everybody's naked. And they're touching each other. They decided to allow nudity in movies. Midnight Cowboy won an Oscar and was rated X. About bloody time. It was liberating for actors and actresses to get nude on the screen. When am I ever going to look this good again? If I hadn't done the nudity, I might not have a career today. I wouldn't have gotten a role had I not had breasts. If I'm naked, people are going to go like this. In America, they go, oh my god. I wasn't prepared for the entire world picking your body apart. You want to be attractive enough that people want you to be naked, but you want to work with people that are going to abuse it. I don't want to be known as the actress who just does nudity. I didn't have the choices that women do today. Now they're there's more of a system of checks and balances. A growing Me Too movement. People are very aware of power dynamics. What price do you put on your body and what are you willing to get naked for? People are afraid of sex and maybe they're a little bit afraid of nudity too. You were looking, you were looking awfully close, weren't you? <laughs> Okay, yeah, I'm totally in for that. Obviously, it is going to have nudity in it. I don't think there was any in that trailer. I think they s stepped around it. I'll be I'll be checking, but um, but no, and that looks awesome. I like that they have Zach and Miri make a porno in there. I like that they're going from very beginning all the way to now. I do think there's going to be some really interesting discussions in there because honestly, too, times have changed. Um, like even me, you know, growing up as a horror film junkie, right? Um, 80s into the 90s would love seeing nudity in horror films, especially when I'm younger, because you know. It was nudity. You're, I'm curious. I'm a curious young boy, right? Nowadays, um, things have changed. I don't necessarily like nudity or sex in my horror films, it, gratuitous anyways, anymore. If it makes sense to the plot of the story, fine. But it doesn't need to be there for the sake of being there because, look, if you're just trying to see somebody naked, the internet exists, you know? So it's like, it's a whole different thing now. Um, it's kind of like the film we made, Zeppo Centers from Beyond the Moon. We intentionally, the joke in that movie, what we tried to do and just barely maybe achieved was we wanted to have so much exploitive nudity in that film that it became laughable. Um, so there's literally nudity every 10 minutes. We would have liked to have had more so that joke would have worked, but it didn't. And that was made in like 2007, just before, you know, internet stuff really took off. So there was definitely even an indie film, a trend of trying to sell movies based on sexuality and nudity. Um, they stopped selling so well because people could find it everywhere else. So even that's like an interesting topic of discussion. So I think that's going to be a really fascinating documentary and something I would definitely be into because I love documentaries. I love filmmaking. I love the history of cinema. 
I love naked people. So it's got all, it ticks all the boxes. But how do you all feel about it? Does that look good to you? Is that a documentary you'd like to see? How do you feel about nudity in films? Has your attitude changed with time? Let me hear your thoughts. Definitely geek out with me in the comments below. I look forward to hearing what you have to say. Other than that, you can click the thumbs up button. Give me that good old thumb of encouragement if you want to. I do love to be encouraged. And of course, you can check out my Patreon by looking up the Eric Butts or using the links in the description below. Then remember, we will get through this. We will get through this together with internet porn. And, oh geez. All right, on that note, I'm going to get out of here so I can go watch some more stuff. I'll see you all later.